Hi everybody, welcome back. It's three songs a week. This is the third song. Um, this song, as you probably can see, is House of the Rising Sun. Now, I listed it as traditional because I don't do it the way the animals did it. The song was written, no one really knows who wrote it. It's just a folk song, and uh, it's been done from the perspective of a man or a woman. I've always heard it, and for a long time, from the perspective of a woman. As a matter of fact, the first time I ever heard it from the perspective of a man was when the animals did it. Because I think it fits better as a woman. Uh, House of the Rising Sun, House of Ill Repute. She's going to go back to a life of prostitution because that's the only way she can make a living, maybe. Who knows? It's a, supposed to be a tragic song, I think. So um, I don't do it the way the animals do it. You'll, we'll talk, I can talk a little bit about that afterwards. In New Orleans, they call the horizon sun. It's been the ruin of many poor girls. You gotta know I'm one. If I to what my mama said I'd be at home today but I was young foolish your love let a gambler lead me astray Now the only thing a gambler needs is a suitcase and a trunk. And the only time he's satisfied is when he's on a drum. Tell my baby sister, don't you do what I have done, but shun that house in New Orleans. They call the rising sun. It's one foot on the platform, the other on the train. Well, I'm going back to New Orleans, where that ball and chain. Yes, I'm going back to New Orleans. My race is almost run. I'm going back to end my life beneath the rising sun. Yeah, there is a house in New Orleans that they call the Rising Sun. And it's been the ruin of many poor girls. And God, I know I'm one. Oh, 
God I know I know I'm one So there it is House of the Rising Sun a la Cone I mean it can be done all kinds of ways so the animals do A minor C with the C like this and then they go to a D and to an F and they continue that it's and then it's A minor C to E so what I'm doing is I'm running the bass down instead I'm doing A minor then it's a C but I'm using a G bass so I can run the bass and I'm doing a, a D D seventh but I'm doing a D with the F bass F sharp bass and then the F so I get this As opposed to which is that's fine I like that too and sometimes when I play this I sometimes in a verse will do that chord progression instead not with the arpeggios that they did but um, but I like the bass run I just love running that bit down and I think it sounds really bluesy as a matter of fact you're really not supposed to go to that D uh, in the second verse you're supposed to go directly from uh, a minor C to E, but I like going A minor C with the G bass. Add that that D in there anyway to bend it down and then go to the E hard. You know, makes it sound really bluesy. So that's the difference. You can do anything. Um, I keep telling people when they're learning, uh, you're the arranger. It's your song. Do it the way you feel it. So uh, I always recommend that. So anyway, that's it for this week. I've accomplished three songs a week, and it's just Saturday, so I can take tomorrow off. Probably will work on a couple songs anyway. It's been really exciting. Dimming of the Day and um, uh, Bird on a Wire were, were, were things that I had thought of maybe doing way down the line when I you know, needed to learn them. And I'm really glad I learned them sooner than later. So um, it's been good for me. All right. Hope you enjoyed it. Subscribe if you like. Thanks for coming. See you next week.